Now you might be wondering why we have more WordPress tutorials on our channel than I can even try to count. And we've covered so many different themes and designs and the reason is because of the themes. So this demo site we made uses the Sydney theme and of course it turned out really professional but we're limited by where the theme wants things to go. For example, the button has to go here, the text goes here. But in Elementor, you can move anything. You can click on a button and go ahead and move it. You can easily just drag it. So wherever you want things to go, they'll go there. Let's say you wanna change where this text goes. Just click on the column settings, advanced, delete this up here, boom, done. And we just moved some text. Or maybe you saw a really neat part of another website that you want to use, like here on our Laurel website demo. We want to create these three floating featured boxes with the button on top of them. Well, boom, we just did it. And because we did it in Elementor, we can change everything from the size of the text, the font, to the width of the boxes, to even the amount of shadow around the boxes. It's super easy, you don't need to know anything about code and you can do this on a Mac, PC, or whatever type of computer you have. Or maybe you're spending your time hanging out on some other website, like this random computer store, and you're like, whoa, man, these features are cool. I wanna learn how to make that one right there. We just did it again all using Elementor, and more importantly, with your own text, your own ideas, your own images, all with professional tools that any of us can figure out. So I hope to show you that the websites you browse on a daily basis aren't that complicated, and with the right tools in this tutorial, you can actually create almost anything you see on the web and make it all happen on your own website.